We are broadcasting live from Don't Ever Bake Here Field in Cracksome Skull, Florida, where elections can't be broken because <laughs> they're always fixed. The fans are ready for some mutant football. Well, I'm going to make like a presidential election ballot and disappear because I got to pee. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The insane Colts go up against the Cracks and Skull Jugulars. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Hello again, everybody. Grim Blitzrow here, along with Brickhead Mulligan. That's me. And his mutant hobbit head that lives on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. How about you shut the fuck up? Well played, Jr. Moving on. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bender right now. Devastating hit knocks the ball loose. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. First and ten. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about bad hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he picks up about six on the play. Third down and eight. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Slice its way through any defense. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a throw that good, Grim! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Well, the 
it should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> right through. Yeah, like a double-stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Second down in a very lot. way out of and that's a great nine yard completion there hey it ain't great if you don't score or move the chains third down and nine takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. Huh? Huh? a gain of 10 yards. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and 10. You can't keep a good mute. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. First and eight to go. Man, what a hit that was. And that'll bring up second and one. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. If you think his dancing is bad, you should have been here in the old days. He used to mark their territory the old-fashioned way. But they agreed to dial it down to uh, interpretive dance. I took an interpretive dance class with a werewolf once, Grim. He damn near clawed my face off. That was before the class even started. Keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. Oh, oh, could it be mine? And it's first and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. He's up. If he was still talking, he'd be saying, 
Psycho killer Keska say, what the fuck, 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 fuck. And it's first and ten. And that'll bring up second and one. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize those two. Hey, don't give these reps any ideas, you idiot. Friend, I just dash. On it. Second down in a line. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. Chunk of yards on that pass play. And that'll bring up third and one. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. No, they don't have enough faith in their offense to put it in the end zone, so they're taking the easy route. points and let's move on when you give up points you need to get them back here comes the kickoff let's see if they can make them pay and it's first and ten the sticks moving he picks up five yards on that play second down and five Second down and four. I think the defenders are scared of this guy, Bricks, and they have every right to be. Yeah, he's a murderer! And it's first and ten. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes, I like it. Second down and two. Oh, with a punishing hit.
first down and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Looks like he does have some turkey skin wrapping on his backside from that bad burn he had last year. <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. First and ten. Oh no, so the receiver explodes and everyone on both sidelines looks very angry. Well, he owed him a lot of money from what I hear, Tim. Like a lot. First down and forever. Catches it for six yards. Good mitts on that play, Bricks. His fingers are like a bunch of sausages. Second down in a very lot. Two minutes left in the half. Second down and more than the QB would like. Just burn the defense pretty hard on that one. That nah, is still edible, though. Just gotta sweep off the charge parts. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And that'll bring up third and one. the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. kids to think I'm cool. Well, why go for one when you can go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. No one was going to stop him. That's two points. for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. Boom! And it's first and ten. Huh? Huh? The defense is on the one speed dirty trick. Man, look at He'll pick up seven yards on that play. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. Second and three. Just follow the 
bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Quinn? Aren't we all? Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. <laughs> <laughs> and it's first and ten, and they take their last time out. It's between them and the clock now, Grim. Well, and the defense, too. The drive was stalled, and here comes the field goal attempt. comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room. And we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. And these guys are neck and neck to begin the third quarter. You talking about that two Siamese twins playing opposing tackles? Yeah, they're putting on a hell of a show. <laughs> the home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. Man, how did he screw that up? No one died. Bombs don't kill mutants, Grim. Mutants kill mutants. Second down and ten. And the ground game is starting to soften up the defense. First down. And it's first and ten. First and ten. Oh, big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Yeah, big deal. Mr. Meat for Brave Man with a ball that didn't fall down. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. No, oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. He turned into a mutant fireball with that flame on dirty trick. And anything he touches. Down. 
And it's first and ten. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And that'll be second and eight to go. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and eight. First and ten. No, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Second down and ten. points so they're going for two and perfect pass for two points that's a piece of art right there bricks yeah man the QB turned the defense into an abject mess <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score hey speak for yourself I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, man, I know a guy if that's what you're after. Second down and six. And the defense jumps off sides trying to... If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. And it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. Oh, look at this guy breaking. And that's a catch for three yards. Second down and seven. still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league, 
where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can't we all just... Not this shit again. Brex, I'm stopping it right there. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And it's first and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not gonna take it anymore. First down in a mile. And he pounds the ball into the defense, picking up seven. Second down in a lot. Don't worry, if he shocks you to death, maybe he can shock you back to life, man. Oh, welcome to Fumble Town, USA. Population, this guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. <laughs> okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabag after that hit. And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. Ouch! What is this, Andy's wrestling? First and ten. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. That'd be fantastic. Fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaur. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want a nitpick. Second down and ten. Oh. Oh. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. The only thing the QB can do now is run for his life. <laughs> or die.
Third down, and the punter is warming up. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. If he had getting killed by a chicken, oh, another average oh, 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 Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. It's a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. And he rumbles for big yardage on that play. They're back in business, Bricks. My mom told me to stay out of other people's businesses, Grim. Third down and three. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. First and ten. Defense goes work speed. And the defender just turned on his jet. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I uh, tap off my drink. When do they do that? Second down and six. <laughs> Pass finds its target. A pickup of six yards on the play. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the timeout there in halftime. And the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time. It's a touchdown! Looks like someone uploaded some new dance moves. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. He caught it. That's two points and even more momentum on their side. I can feel the momentum shifting. For the last time, you're not a Jedi, Bricks. He'll be going onside here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. They usually only talk about kickers when they win or lose games. Well, this guy just earned his paycheck. Which is typically the amount the quarterback tips on dinner. And it's first and ten. Two yards on the catch. They use 
use their second timeout, but they are running out of time. A uh, bit pessimistic, don't you think so, Grim? It's more about building tension, Bricks. That's all we do at this point, and drink this bourbon. Come on, give me that. <laughs> Chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. changes the pace by going into a hurry up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry up too? Catch the ball, get the first down and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock and he better win. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. done for a first down first down and the offense quickly calls their second time out that's how you do it do what first down and seven Two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. And the hurry-up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has... And the jugglers just got their butts handed to them and lose the game in front of their home team fans. They fought tooth and nail, but in the end, lose by three. It's a hell of a thing losing at home. They took away all they've got and all they're ever going to have. Yeah, well, they played like shit. Fuck them. Fuck them indeed, Junior. Let's go down the field and see what that meathead has to say about his MVP award. <laughs> with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every opportunity.